The United Steelworkers Union in Canada is deeply concerned about the brutal violence and repression against the people of Belarus. Our union represents more than 225,000 workers in nearly every sector of the economy, including mining. We have close ties with unions around the world. After more than two months of peaceful protests against a fraudulent election, the illegal detentions, the arrests of thousands of protesters, and the severe clamping down on reporters continues. Our union is horrified with what is happening right now in Belarus. As citizens demand the right to free elections, opposition leaders have been pushed into exile out of fear for their safety or have been arrested. Human rights organizations report the torture and abuse of detained protesters. We are very concerned about the arrest of trade unionists who have taken part in peaceful protests. This includes Nikolai Zimin, former president of the Mining and Chemical Workers Union, BNP, and Marksim Sereda, the chair of the Independent Trade Union of Miners. The police have detained more than 20 workers participating in peaceful actions against a state potash mining company. These workers were demanding the resignation of the company's director and the release of other miners who have been detained while joining the political protests. We commend the courage of our Belarusian people, the thousands who are standing up against an authoritarian government. Our union joins the international union movement in denouncing the violent attacks by the police and special security forces against the people of Belarus. We demand that authorities immediately stop all violence and illegal detentions. We demand that the imprisoned union leaders, activists, and members of civil society are released immediately. Our solidarity is with you on behalf of the steelworkers here in Canada.